as Designius told you, this is a new version and it brings a block called Design Updater. And you can probably guess sort of what it does uh, looking at this sign here. But, well, I'll go through it anyway. So if I put a manch here and a sign here, and I actually forgot to grab a sign, uh, sign there. So if I have a sign here now, I can update it through the um, Sign Updater. As you can see, that's the front, so it's facing the, uh, the sign there. And what I'll have to do is, well, obviously I'll have to trigger it some way. You can do it with resin or whatever. But just trigger it and then use the sign updater here. And these are pretty straightforward. You select the uh, sign updaters you want, or just one if you so like. And then you specify its text. So we have four um, lines here for the four lines of the uh, design. And I can just type something like, hello, hello, uh, like that. And then uh, this is the second. Well, I can't fit a line because you can only have 15 characters in one line. And uh, yeah, whatever. But if you want to, you can also disable one line. So if I type something in and uh, deselect update there, that's not actually going to be set. So if we do that, we can see that now uh, all of those shows up, but not the final line. And the reason why is since I deselected it, and what you can do with that is if you want to. Maybe you want to set like, uh, let's see, uh, maybe you want to have one here uh, that updates only the first line, which says uh, important, for instance, like that. So we just update the header, and then depending on what's important at the moment, with some conditions and so on, uh, I don't know what conditions, maybe resident conditions, maybe uh, liquid conditions, I don't know, we, we, we split it up like this to do different things. Uh, and so on, and depending on that, we might want to uh, update everything but the first one. So we we put something below it there. And as you can see, we have the uh, this is the second, and uh, all those dashes there still there, even though we've updated uh, after that, just because we don't update the other lines. So it's pretty straightforward. Just tell it what you want to update the text with, and that's what it's going to do. And of course, you can put signs on it like that as well, and it's going to update anyway. As you can see now, it says important. The rest is gone because we're not. Uh, well, updating that anymore. So now it's just as important, and if I place another sign there, it's going to update and say important as well. And what's going on here is obviously that this is a cluster block with a camouflage and a sign updater. It's actually also containing an emitter to create sort of a timing system, so it just goes through four different states. Super simple, super straightforward. That's pretty much it. Good luck.